Hello everyone, in this video I am going to show you that how you can add product slider into your Shopify store. So currently I am using down theme, this is the latest one and you already know that everything is in JSON and it is quite difficult to inject the code. So I created the code and you only need to copy and paste that code and then you are done. So I have written the blog post which you can see over here and you only need to follow each and every step which I will be showing you in this video and then after you will uh, able to add uh, this kind of slider onto your uh, Shopify store. All right. So uh, currently this slider is available but uh, for example if I am interested to uh, remove this slider and start uh, from the very beginning that how you should do step by step. So for that uh, I am going to delete this specific file which I have already added. So I have added the file which is product-slider.liquid. Let me delete this. This is deleted. And now let's go to the dashboard. So here is the dashboard. So the first thing uh, which we need to do here is we need to follow this blog post. So the first thing is that go to theme actions, edit code and then sections. So here in the dashboard of the Shopify store we have themes then we have actions and on the left hand side you can see that this is the down theme. Then you should click on edit code. So once you will click on edit code then after you will be redirected to uh, files and folders of the backend where you will have to add your code. So here you can see that we have some folders like layout, templates, you only need to open the sections and then after the second step is create section and name it product-slider. So you should name a section which is product-slider, you can copy from here and click on add a new section, paste the name and click on create section. Once you are done then the next step is paste below code in this new file. Uh, product-slider.liquid but before continuing this let me show you if you will see on this uh, screen you will no more able to find that uh, slider why because that has been removed and let me show you uh, one more thing which is if I am clicking on theme in the new tab and here let me click on customize and on the left hand side you will have this add section and down below you will be getting some options so here we don't have any option of uh, adding a product slider all right so we are going to build that specific section and that would be uh, added over here later on for now i have actually uh, added one sections here uh, just a moment Yeah, this section is not available and this one is also not available. Why? Because I have already created and then after I deleted that uh, file. So that's why this is uh, no more over here. So let's continue the second thing which is uh, paste below code in the new file product-slider.liquid and then save changes. So you only need to copy this uh, whole code which is like this. So let's copy. So complete code you need to copy from here. Let me copy this. Then after you should go to this new file which you have just created. Delete the uh, code and then paste the new code which we have just copied. And then click on save. Now if I am refreshing this page. Then you will see that the slider is over here. So that means we have implemented the slider successfully. Alright. But let me show you how you will be adding from the customized section. Let me refresh this page. And now you will find out that uh, we have that section available if you are interested to add multiple sliders on, onto your home uh, screen. So here you can see that we have product slider. This slider I uh, created earlier. Let me remove this. And uh, then after this one more section I created before. So let me click on add section. So for example I am clicking on save, let me click on uh, refresh this page and now you will no more able to see that slider. What you have to do is you should click on add section, then here you can see that product slider, click on this and here we need to uh, mention the name. 
so i have already written the product sliders name but you can also rename it to anything and that would be reflected uh, on this title all right then after you should add uh, products over here so let me select a product so for example this product i selected then after you should click on add product card once again and click uh, another specific product and then again i am going to call, uh, add a card so here we go this was the third product then we are interested to add one more product so here you can see that uh, this one is the fourth product then for example i am interested to add one more product so now you can see that i have added five products all right then click on save changes and if you are clicking on this product slider option on the right hand side you will also get an option of change the number of cards in view so if you are interested to uh, increase to four then four number of products would be showing and if you are clicking on th three then three uh, products would be visible so i have already saved so let me refresh this page again so this is actually my home page you can see that this is the home page and on the bottom you can see that we have product slider you can change this title and other than that we have this slider which is sliding uh, smoothly actually my system is little slow so when i am using video editor uh, at that moment uh, this uh, thing is not loading properly so you can change and modify according to your uh, requirement once you are implementing this into your uh, system then it will not uh, uh, create any problem all right uh, this is slow because my uh, video recorder is also uh, working right now so system is not uh, capable to uh, run both these things all right so this is the way to uh, add your products for example i am adding here three then let's save now let's refresh this page again and you will see that we have something like this so for example you are interested to change the color of these uh, arrows so that you can also improve so here you can see that in this code i have added a red color let me show you if you will scroll it then here is the uh, for example i am writing here black let's save let's refresh the page and here we go you can see that this these arrows are now uh, with black background color all right so if you want to change the color inside of it then you can also change for example here we have white i am writing here red let me save these changes let ref let's refresh this page and now you can see that these arrow color is uh, red and background color is uh, black all right so this is pretty simple you can also implement and once you are done then uh, uh, then it is okay otherwise if you are facing any problem you can ask me below in the comment section i will help you out if you still not able to do all this stuff then you can uh, message me uh, i will be adding the contact details below in the description so feel free to ask the questions and uh, do a comment in the comment section so keep watching the videos i will uh, if you are new on this channel then please subscribe this channel and also like this video thank you so much once again see you in the next video